This looks good. Right, greetings and welcome to this game. Stranded. Truth be told, this is an adventure game. Sci-fi, I have no idea what's going to await us. So, just let's get to it. Okay? Okay. I'm assuming this is us. Let me just go to screenshot. Okay, what am I looking at? This room of tanks. By clicking on the character, I can actually open some sort of menu. Mm. Clicking the middle mouse button does this. I have no clear kind of menu, but two doors. Clicking on this does. Do you want to restart and wait for no? What? I can now move actually. Moving somewhere locks the mouse into it. So are we strand? Ooh, holy frack. That doesn't look good at all. engines basically axed. Oh here. Hell? Let's just the other side. Pretty well. Embrace freedom. Embrace totality. Embrace! Oh we can't. We actually can't jump down. While I find that most peculiar, I just find that just as well. Well I wouldn't want to jump down to a bit old. But I need to check it anyway. Can't even do anything. Interesting. Oh wait, can I can I no the mouse locks. Oh wait, the mouse does not lock up. Interesting. He, he she, or the person basically stopped moving. Hmm? Okay, we're back in here. Final sequence active portal released. I wonder where the other tanks are. No one here. I don't have the specific look function, so I can't take a look at this. Can I move down here? We can. It's a cave! Wandering through an alien world. Okay, apparently the Mayas and the Aztecs have been here before. The hell? Hello? Anyone home? Okay, maybe it has been the Toltecs instead. Hmm, and I don't think that their sacred letter is is the chair letter. It's an H, isn't this? Or maybe something different. It's a B? Interesting. What, 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 what does it mean? What, what is this? What? No, no. What? Is this a map? What, what does this mean?
I have, I have no idea what I'm actually doing here right now. Or even why. It seems clear that yes, we are stranded. I can gather that much, but where are we? Why are we here? Who are we? What are our capabilities? Except we are wearing a red, right suit of some sort. Also, where do you lead? You, you move, please. Move, 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 move. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, move, 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 please. Come. Oh, come on. I played Leisure Suit Larry games but were less dense. The hell? Okay, so far this is basically the, the Nevada planet. Let's call it Nevada. Planet Nevada. We have been stranded on planet Nevada. Great. The hell? There are more of these? Also, why does this one have an Omega sign? Are these the Alpha and Omegas? Because that wouldn't be creepy or anything, right? Finding strange alien structures. What the hell? I... Okay, I've apparently explored more areas now, but I still don't know what they mean. Or why I would do that. Also, I've found nothing so far to interact with. Nothing. I can move around, I know of that capability, and apparently this is a sort of map, because this is the H temple, and this is the small area where the mushrooms are, and we know that this is basically the Omega temple, which might or might not be actually um, some sort of alien temple. It might not be, uh, if case in point it actually is something like Ancient Mayans built this temple centuries ago, but we don't know. We don't know anything about this game, actually. We don't know anything. That's usually how it goes, isn't it? Oh well. Oh well, 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 well. Okay, we are back at our crash ship. Now let's see what's to the left of this here. There certainly is an area where... the hell? It's a giant old egg warrior! Let's follow it, because that's always a clever idea. I mean, we don't have anything else to interact with, to be told. Game, you can't just give me places to, to look at and not do anything with it. That seems weird. Now at the V Temple. Can, I, can we talk? I don't have an inventory either, so no idea what I'm actually supposed to do here. Or if I even can do anything. Also the music has changed. Considerably even. That is if we talk about style basically. Oh, don't tell me I'm not walking in circles. No, I'm not. Well, I am partially, but beside the point really. Temple number four. And this one doesn't even have doors, this one has just this. An infinite icon. Or sort of wings maybe? Sure. 
Let's go there. Come on, go, go. Okay, we are clever enough to actually ignore them. Can't do anything here. What? No. I, I'm sorry. I, I know that at times I might seem like I'm I have a I do have a highly inflated opinion of myself, but even then with only this given I doubt most people can actually figure out what they're supposed to do. I have a feeling like the signs of these let's call them places of worship because I'm not entirely sure these are actually temples. We might actually have some sort of puzzle there, where we might need to activate something like um, like pressure plates or something similar. But there's there's no inferred. These are implied meanings because I have experience of puzzle games, not so much because the game has told us you need to do this or given us any hint that we have to do this. All of this could be a red herring for all I I know right now, and that's that's not good puzzle design, not at all. I mean, let's f wait until nightfall and then we'll take a second look. Maybe something will change. Well, I have a feeling that I'm I am missing something. Okay, we explored all of these areas. Do you want to rest in which country? Yeah. Branded. Just in case you didn't know what you were actually playing by now. Oh boy, oh boy, this is going to be great, isn't it? Oh yeah. What doors released? Let's go visit the giant hmm, things. What the hell? So can I can I now talk to you? Oh, can I take the door and serve on it? Okay, apparently our map at night is different from our map at day, which is strange, but okay. The changes in the maps are in. Ooh, this looks cool. Hello. Um. Bone plants are always a plus. Also, hello giant strange stone constructs. I mean, I do feel like I've suddenly wandered into some sort of Studio Ghibli movie. Only weirder. Or indie. And... Maybe with a horror undercurrent? The hell? You know, just in case you didn't realize that the V was asked for. Remember though, V is color green. I have a feeling like, oh yeah, it's in glowing green, cool. I have a feeling like the colors are going to make part of a puzzle for this. I don't know guys, This so far this seems kind of non-interactive. Let's go with it like this. We'll make our run around and if we still can't interact with anything, we'll go to the next game. The hell? This is also glowing green? Also, why you be sitting, buddy? What is why is Robo why is Robo friend? Um we can't enter there. 
Interesting. And of course, because we are nearby for whatever the source for the interference is, we can't actually call up our map. The only thing we can actually or we actually realize is part of our suit basically and our abilities that we can actually do except walk. If this is some sort of waiting simulator then I'm going to leave it a minute. Because made like this. No, no no no. Hello Stone Guys! What was it? Um, Flying Castle of Laputa? Wasn't it Laputa? Where they actually had these stone giants? I think they had these there. I am though not entirely sure. I th yeah, I think it was Laputa. Though in uh, Nelskar, in um, um, Valley of the Winds and the uh, Princess Nausicaa, basically. Ooh, cool! They uh, had the giant. Um, they had the machines as well. This move. Oh. A moment there, there was no movement. You know, it could move a little bit slow. No, not slow. Please don't move slow. Yay! Go to the chair temple! We will find a chair person! <laughs> it is the hat! Are you the chair? <laughs> oh, age of blue! The chair is blue. So V is green and chair is blue. Why? I... I mean, this is cool and all, and it does look kind of sci-fi, you know, fascinating sort of exploration, but... What? I am missing a purpose to this. Content without reason is empty. And just like that, reason without content is pointless. This has been your Philosophy Minute with Richard Ehrman. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, I'm sure you can already guess how perplexed I am by this game, because I am really, really perplexed by this game. Oh yeah, let's sure. Let's go to the Omega Way. The Om you know that sounds like some sort of cool spy movie from the 60s or 70s. The Omega Wing, especially considering that the Omega Man was a really great movie. Ma I think it was with Charles Hanson, wasn't it? Ooh, oh my god, red! Music's changed again, by the way. I... Okay, you have six more minutes to convince me, otherwise your time is going to go up in a flame! Also, music's fading away now? Yeah, let's leave the other cell phone exit. Oh, there is no cell phone. How stupid of me not to understand that there's no way out of this. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Maybe there's something on the other side of our ship. Maybe there's a way out. Most likely there isn't, but it doesn't hurt. Look. Yay! Chip! Also, our ship only has one room, which strangely enough is our stasis. 
Absol. Also, the game is apparently resolution locked, just so you know, which is why you now have a black bar on the side. I... Okay, let's go to another place once again. Maybe there is some sort of color game in here. Chair was blue, we was green, and the Omega is red. But should the giant stone robot not have left his place, we are still unable to enter there. And therefore all of this will have been pointless. Why? Beats me! I mean, I can presume that, yeah, most likely there is some sort of sense to it. Some reason why this creators thought that, yeah man, let's do it like this. Because that's really cool. It's just that... If nothing's given to the to the player basically, then no. If the experience you give is not an explanation way, but if the symbols remain confusing, then you failed in your mission to transmit the message you wanted to give. Your message remains muddled. A muddled message is never received well. Specifically, as seen by this game. Nope. The hell? Oh, come on now, I got three colors, man. I want to play Sam Says. Yeah. Um, game? Two, three, and eleven. The fuck? The game is just full screened upon me. But I still haven't gotten an interface. And the game's apparently frozen on the display case. Into the hell? Green chart. Yeah. Want to end the session? Yes. Nope. That was bad. And I apologize personally for that. This is not meant to be. That was bad. Let's play something different. I mean, wow. Didn't even imagine something like this would be happening. Let's see. What else does Richard have in his... Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Mmm, something different, basically. Might still be interesting. No, no, no. Good. Now, next game is going to be also. Actually, I think this is quite a classic. Oh boy. Oh god, the resolution's bad. Um. Are you seeing. Oh yeah.
I have lived here, on this Laputa, for my entire life. For me, Earth was nothing but a legend. A distant ball of clouds far below my feet, discussed in whispers among my people. She was a paradise. Paradise lost. Lost in a flash of deadly psionic radiation. We were the chosen, the worthy. Ascended to our Laputa heaven through the efforts of the Council of Earth. The Council never told us what we had been saved from, nor did they tell us what exactly happened to our world. All we were told was that Earth was lost to us, and would remain lost to mankind long after the end of our days. Then things started to go wrong. The life support systems began to fail, and the Council weren't able to effect repairs. Instead of responding to the needs of their people, the Council quelled all discontent firmly and completely by any means necessary. It was soon obvious that they had no idea how the Laputa systems worked. When the people learned of this, violent clashes erupted. The fighting escalated and the Laputa's engines were damaged. The Laputa was disintegrating. Some of us broke the forbidden seals on the docking ports and seized the small craft moored there. None of us were trained in spaceflight, but these vessels were our only hope. Was that just no the sun? And because that was the fastest sun I've ever seen. Holy hell, the thing's gigantic. Yes, as you can see, we are now playing Uvo Aftershock because I have a feeling that this game is going to be better explained than one. I hope. God. I can't select the option, are you kidding me? No! I only want the options, guys! Also, I can't read the tab. And you can't see anything. These no? controls aren't all that different to the interface in our Laputa. I think we'll get the hang of it in no time. Those controls in the lower left manipulate our view of the Earth. We can rotate the view as well as zoom in and out. Why are your lips still moving? There are records in the local library that should prove interesting. Click the research button to open. We found a small capsule here that looks like some sort of transport system. Probably used to transfer people from here to the Earth's surface and back. Some of the humans here who took part in... This tutorial should be enough. Yeah, well... Maybe after I get the ability to actually go into the options menu. Oh god, stop. Oh. Are you kidding me? Please don't. So. It looks really, really bad. Whoever thought that this would be a good idea? <laughs> yes? Whoever thought not egg. Oh, oh, God. 
Yeah. Um. I think you'll understand if I just say no to that. Because crikey, that was frightening. Call it, okay? Yeah. That Let's play something entirely different then, because I have a feeling that the next game is actually going to be on next. What we? Yes, I am sure. Let's play. Yes. Yes, nice. Let's play Risk of Rain. Let me see if I remember the correct positioning for some of these fingers. I'm usually mostly bad for this. Oh yeah, sure. Okay. Yellow. Oh yeah, this was okay. Okay. One, two. Three, four. I need to go as fast as possible. Oop. Okay, this is pointless. This is nice, but still, where is what actually? What was the thing we? Oh, frack! There's a thing we need to actually get access to the boss, but I think I've forgotten how this. Oh, where the teleport is! Right. Hey, yellow. Ninety seconds, staying alive. Whoop, whoop. Oh, 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 oh. It's a magma word. Holy hell! Okay, that was actually kind of pointless. Crack, 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 crack. Leave me alone, please. No, go away, go away. God, please go away, go away. Oh, frack you. Oh frack. Oh no, come on. Yeah, I'm going to die in a second. No, 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 go away. It's not a good sign. Come on, no, 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 go, no, go away, please go away. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Come on, come on. Oh, come on, really? Oh, I hate you so goddamn much. Oh, come on. Don't forget, this is supposed to be very easy. No, 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 it is. Oh, the music's really good, though. Let's look for his ground zero. Hello. Ooh. Oh, damn it. Hey, buddy. Oh wait, what's in you? 
Ooh, gasoline! Wait, setting the ground on fire. That sounds like a nice and nifty little ability. Now, where the hell is that area we are looking for? Huge. This is surprisingly and dangerously huge, even. Like, oh god, this is really, really big, isn't it? Oh man. Whatever balls we're getting for this area is going to be huge as well. This is mine as well. Oh, how do I get? How do I get you? Give me you. I want you. I hate these guys. Well, hate may be is a very strong word. For I actually dislike um, these creatures. That was not nice, Mr. Golem guy. And another level up. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Whoop, the shoop. Come on, what is you? Mysterious vial. Ooh, cool. Didn't have one of those before. You want to make. And stop us hurting enemies by falling. Oh, cool. We are Mario now. What? I don't know these guys actually. No, I kind of. Oh, fuck. So, where the hell is the teleporter platform? Um. No game, you have to place it somewhere, you know. Maybe it isn't down here. Maybe it's up there. Hmm. And of course, it's just short of enough, isn't it always? Ow! You know, I have no idea where the hell that freaking teleporter is. Damage to healthy monsters, okay? Ooh, ceremonial dagger, cool. Cool, 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 cool. I like this one a lot. Oh, we already checked them. The helm can't be up there then. You. Oh, cool. 
but if they had been- oh wait! Got the med kit apparently. Yellow! Yay! Sweet! Apparently, the ability we got from the spirit dagger is really, really good. Um, what is you? Heal quickly when sending silver. Oh, oh, that's less okay. That's just okay. Okay, that was a surprisingly big amount of money we just got in there. Hello! Life savings! Yay! What is you? Meat nuggets! Your house! Bunch of fireworks. Opens the chest, launches fireworks in my Okay, that's rather pointless. Oh, oh, we're actually... Yes, okay. No? Okay, we have by now been far too long in this area, actually. And not only in this area, but basically at this place. This level, basically. I have a feeling like this is going to hurt us a lot, because as you can see, the difficulty has already gone up too easy, and it's not going to go down anymore. Actually, it's going to be even more. Yellow! Regenerating health! Music's kind of funky by now. That's... I like that. I like that. Boom, 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 boom. Was a surprisingly strong attack. Oh, oh right. Rapid my toes reduces cooldown of use items. Okay. Interesting. Ooh. So if we get to the left there with a double jump, we could. Interesting. Well, that means we need to get a double jump. Ow. Now where the hell's that freaking teleporter? Oh, it's up! Oh, are you kidding me? It's up there! Oh, of course it is. I love these ice relics. The ability it gives you is so friggin' strong. Far too strong for my taste, but not for my taste really, no no. But I still like it. Are you? Oh frick me! Of course, of course. No, are you? Now, oh, what the frick? All oh, right, because he has a jump point there. Now jump, and jump, and jump. Oh, damn it! It's a trap. Frick you! I 
I've got far too much money for my good at this point. Yep. Come on, come on, come on. Yep. Chips. Yes, 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 Woo! We got there! We got there! Yes, come, come on. No. Come on. Let me buy. Let me buy. Let me buy. Let me buy. Yes! In a shield. Nice. Oh, crack, 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 crack. No, no, no. No, damn it. Oh, fuck me. Ah, because my hand slipped. You know, you go from one point to the others and... Suddenly it goes all so horribly, horribly worse. Hello! Come on, we can do this. We can do this. Yellow! Right, we now got a shield. Oops. Ah, oh, man, I really love... In my previous playthrough, I had a double jump by quite at some point. That was awesome! But, unfortunately, that means we now need to reacquire the double jump. Because you don't retain these things. Oh, frack, 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 frack. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, boss has been summoned. Come on. Wandering Vagrant. Ba oh, frick me. Oh, come on. E no, 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 no. Frick, 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 frick. No, 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 no. Oh, point, and point. Ah, no, damn it. Point, point, point. Almost, almost. If I got a double jump, this would be toast. Wee! No, no, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Wee! No, damn it. Wee! Oh, sweet. Sweet merciful crap. That's a lot of ice. Come on. Oh, holy hell! That's a deadly sort of cocoon! Look at the Vagrant's HP go! Frack me, that was strong! Come on, 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 no, no, ow! Please stop that! Please! Oh, the time's already run out. I need to kill them now. Damn it. I hate it when that happens. Uh, you know how freaking hard this is. This is really, really hard. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Leave me alone. Leave me, you're freaking alone. Leave me. No, go. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't you dare. No, 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 no. Oh, frag. No, no, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Ignore. Yes! Woo! Whoa! Attack faster, lower health. Oh, you friggin' bastards. Whee! Of course, now we still have to kill the rest. Hello! No, 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 no! 
Come on! Whee! Fuck you! Oh, holy hell! Missed my chance, Vera. Um, hmm. Yes, I know that there are enemies. Thank you for telling me, eh? I would never have guessed otherwise. I think I'm still missing something. Maybe something on the map? Uh, Alright, oh there are actually still items we can- oh fuck. We can buy. Hello. Hello. I mean, if we are going for the very hard difficulty anyway, then... Ow. What's the point? Not buying all this stuff, right? I mean, we do have the money by now. Oh, Yes, we do. Anything up here? Music's going kind of funky there. Oh, it's our capsule! We started the level at this point! Huh. Well, that has been about 80 minutes ago. There, oh right. Maybe I should look at where I'm actually going, but... Ah, it would be too easy. You know, the very first time I actually played this game, which was quite some time ago, if I remember correctly, I was really, really bad at this. I still am, but for a very different reason nowadays. Yep. These are even the last two. Interesting. Out of these two, I can actually leave the level and check out if I can actually survive the next one. Yay! Everyone's dead. Oh, fuck me. The other problem, of course. Yep. Can't get that one single item behind the bench because I don't have double jump and I'm too bad at jumping up a while. 
I wonder what you have to do to actually crew, um, unlock some of the other characters. Because so far I haven't really done that, as you might have seen earlier. And I really would like to have done that at some point. Oh, we are in the fungal ca- Ooh. Okay. Also, no money. But our piggy bank works. It's a bot thingy. 120 HP. Oh, does this co Ooh. Yeah, sure, I'm going to pay for that. Oh, frack me. Well, what is okay? Item law. What did I uh, actually un? Her? I don't see thing. Okay. A lost doll. Yeah, okay, but where is it and what does it... Oh, where? Yeah, but, oh, we haven't found it. We don't... Oh. Okay. Okay. I get what you're trying. <laughs> the game crashed. <laughs> oh, man. <sighs> this reminds me of simple times back in the day, you know. Well, 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 simple. Like way back. Right. Right, let's see. What else do we have? Um this one. Also strand in the window. Right, let's play this one because I really did like it. Let's play... yeah. I think that's a good one. Maybe... I do hope you'll like this one as well. Let's play... no oh, come Let's play Convoy. I found this was a really nice game last time I played this. And I recently found it again and started it up and basically thought uh, to myself, well, yeah, I really want to do this. And is supposedly running, but I don't know where it is. Come on, OBS. On OBS. Oh yeah, sweet! We got picture now, or image? Signal? I think signal's okay. We got signal! Sweet! Um, okay. Right now, that's the only thing.
Aim. Aim. Hello. Anyone home? Um. It's weird. We're probably fine last time I played it. Didn't take even a minute to load, basically. That's not bad. Five out again. Shooting arrows. Okay, now he's going further. <laughs> Installing guns. Four of twenty. Um, now he's doing now. generating box. Okay, this looks good. Oh, oh no. The game almost crashed upon me. Okay. Right, let's play Convoy, a game where we actually crash on a desert planet. Now, uh, let's see. Um, uh, yeah, I have actually played this a bit, not too much, of course, because, you know. Um, yeah, no, I don't think the chainsaw guys are too good, really. Let's go with this one. This is a laser and a heavy MG, which is really strong starting up. We're going with medium. We are going to continue on our path. Welcome to Convoy. Hello! After flying through an asteroid field, your spaceship was forced to make an emergency landing on the planet Omec Prime due to critical damage to its primary systems. The captain has ordered you to traverse the planet in search of replacement parts. Obtaining these will allow the spaceship to continue its mission. I know! Onwards! Yellow! Now, as you can see, the planet Omega Prime is divided into three different areas. Green, oh, four basically, which is Privateers, Green, Torvac, which is blue, and the Raiders, which is red. Basically, we have Asshole Pirates, you have Cyber Pirates, and you have Asshole Cannibal Pirates. In either case, all of these guys are bad guys and they want to shoot us, which from our point of view, of course, is bad, because we want to leave this planet alive. So let's do our best in trying to do that, okay? Okay. Right, now let's see. Now this shows us where the next target actually is, and we are, of course, moving along the territories here on the Hexfield map, which, as far as I'm told, is where um, the signal appears to be coming from a lone privateer vehicle. Vehicle. It seems to have noticed your convoy. It starts its engine and attempts to raise up. Chase it! Whoop whoop! Come on, come on. As you chase up the privateer, it turns out it to lead you right into an ambush. The privateers get several shots in on your convoy before you have a chance to react. Ready, weapons! Right. Blast them all to bits! Navigation systems ready. Navigation systems ready. I, Commander. Magnetron on standby. Standing by. Pointing in the right direction. Generators ready. Navigation systems ready. Magnetic fields commencing. Standing by. Need a little force? My power is irresistible. So as you can see, the game in the start is a little bit slower because, you know, our vehicles haven't yet been repaired and basically we are slowly building up our arsenal. But in time, that actually comes to pass. Navigation systems ready. Pointing in the right direction. Moving within range. Generators ready. Standing by. Point me in the right direction. Navigation systems ready. Standing by. Magnetron on standby. Navigation systems ready. I somehow seem to remember that the heavy MG was stronger, but apparently it isn't. Standing by. Victory! <gasps> also, ouch. 
and take some loot. We got 8 points of fuel and 35 points of scrap. Nice. So, let's see. It was stupid of us, but doesn't mean that we can't take something else. You are being funneled by some privateers. They demand you give them 50 scrap or they'll open fire upon you. <laughs> open fire. Damn it. Need a little fort? Oh, shite. Oh, no. Navigation systems ready. Need a little fort? Navigation systems ready. This might actually be a problem for us. Standing by. Generators ready. Navigation systems ready. Magnetron on standby. Standing by. I commander. Damn it. We no Standing no damn by. it. Oh, okay, Navigation I think it's ready. Alright, I suppose. Oh, come on. They don't dare close the rift to us, but we'll need... oh no! Standing by. No! Damn it! Enemy spotted. Steady as she goes. Standing by. I commander. Steady as she goes. No, no, you stay there. Yes! Ooh, nice! Got them to destroy themselves! It's always a plus. Still, we need to desperately get to this camp so we might actually refuel or repair our vehicles, because otherwise, we're going to be dead as a doornail. And... Right, let's see. Now we'll have to repair him and, of course, the big one. Next, let's hope that the shop has something good for us. Which they don't. Don't need any fuel right now. Crack. This is each drone is interesting, but not really what we're looking for. Damn it. Well, 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 well. Not to be disheartened, of course. Doesn't mean that we are going. A voice calls to you out on the radio. You are the scumbags that stole a lot of food cubes. Claim that you know nothing of these huge groups. The privateers don't seem interested in your protests and start firing. Many weapons! Navigation right. systems ready. I commander. I the commander. Hell? Standing by. Standing by. Damn it, ready. I didn't I really didn't see that for a second ago. Steady as she goes. I commander. Standing by. Navigation systems ready. Standing by. Standing by. Damn it, missed my chance to get that one. Standing Boy. by. Speed to full. Speed to full. Steady as she goes. Aha! Gotcha. Navigation systems ready. Speed to full. Steady as she goes. You'll find some loot in the wrecks. Ooh, nice. These are sad times when men are forced to violence due to hunger. I'm not going to be story of that. Like, that's enough for them. You arrive at the office of Eiffel's Incorporated. A large building which probably also houses the actual production facility surrounded by an electric fence. It looks exceptionally well defended. The fence has auto turrets positioned along its circumference. You see signs indicating a minefield and heavy vehicles patrol the perimeter. Perimeter, okay, the per not perimeter. 
off, guys. Before you can approach any further, someone attempts to radio you. Open communications. Welcome to Eiffel Incorporated. You have been cleared for a meeting with our chief. Yes, approach the office. Look around. Uh, swipe the shipment list. That's right. What the? 1,500 for the parts. No. You no, you have a monopoly. What is it? What do they want? Um, an individual that stands in their way. Very well. Um, but, 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 um, why have a deep Yeah, the list might be nice to have, but right now we can't ambush for shit for that. It's really possible. The desert sun burns away with no respite. The temperature gorges of your engines are rapidly rising. Focus on cooling the engines. Thanks to your effort, the sun having passed its highest point, and your engine temperatures have returned to normal without causing any damage. Otherwise, they would have blown out. A signal is coming from a garage situated here in the desert. A broken down neon sign reads Caesar's Chop Shop. Investigate. Upon heading inside, you spot a grey haired man. He is busy dissembling parts left and right while bobbing his head and drumming on whatever he's got his hands onto a rhythm only he can hear. It sounds pretty kitschy. Let's talk to him. Caesar looks up at the approach. New face. Welcome, what can I do for you? What's so business? Run and chop shop here. Talking business is easy. I'll fix our armories, what do I do best? Take a look at more stuff you got inside, could probably use some fixing. Uh, I'll fix it all up, except the big one. How does 30 scraps sound for the lot? No questions asked from where it counts. Uh, nope, prepared to die. <laughs> After some well aimed shots, Caesar drops to the floor in a bloody mess. And for inspection of a shop shop, you managed to collect 36 points of scrap. Thank you, bye bye. You might think, oh, that was nice. Yeah, well, this world is nice. This game is. To that regard. Hello? Oh. You can! Please repair me. Quickly. Okay. We found a shield module. Can't use. Frack. <laughs> oh, wait, we can. Sweet, merciful crap. Upgrading everything. When I say everything, I mean everything. No oh, wait. Don't really need my guard to be killed. Um, health, armor, ranged over now. Done. Oh, what? Uh, do I have a nice weapon? Okay. Oh man, they got a new car! Real oh, it's so expensive! I want a new car! Crack me! Even the guns are expensive. Okay. Okay. Oh man. Yeah. Oh. This is awesome. Need one. Ah, oh, damn it. If I had thought about that a minute ago. Shite. <clears throat> and I don't know if I still sell that a minute later. Which is this worth? Except for 22, yeah, no, that's not good. I do need the EMP blast, otherwise we can basically go and pack it in. We are going to need to collect more scrap. Come on, bandits! Oh, there. As you drive down the road, you see a car off to the side with a white flag hanging out the window. Let's investigate! You get closer and see the car's riddled with bullets and scorch marks. Whoever did this doesn't seem to be nearby now. Do you manage to script a vehicle for 70 scrap? Holy moly! Give me that car. Come on. Hello? Give me a car. Yeah. Awesome or awesome? I'd say awesome. <laughs> one point in range, one point in health, and one point in armor. <gasps> Road Rage! Oh, Dog 2. Let's call it, um. Or? Rubber, rubber Sauce! I like Rubber Sauce. It sounds silly enough for me. They can. Right, let's investigate those other areas. Bye bye! What is this up there? Oh, wow, so many clicks. 
You notice a smoking privateer behind you in the distance. It is emitting an emergency signal. Let me investigate. As you approach, you see. Hello there, matey. I seem to be down on my luck. I don't suppose you could help me out. I'll make it worth your while. Yeah, no. Shoot him and scrap us. The privateer notices the attack and decides to put up a fight. Before you have time to shoot him, he points his own weapon at his fuel tank and blows his vital up, damaging your convoy in the process. Fucking bastard. I mean, it's not unexpected, truth be told, but still. As you are driving along, you spot an object by the side of the road. Investigate. <laughs> After dusting off your object, you appears to be a medium rocket artillery? What? Holy moly! The radio signal turns out to be a distress signal. A KJL trading company caravan is being attacked by privateers and they are asking for help. Their coordinates aren't too far from their head towards the fight. You soon spot the skirmish. It turns out most of the caravan has already been destroyed, but the few remaining vehicles are busy fighting the privateers. Engage! If I can get uh, an additional helper on like this, then hell yeah, I'm Attack going for it. I was born ready. Don't mess with my head. Holy shit, the cannon's great. Oh, frack me. Oh, he's stealing help from his own people. Oh, this is awesome. No, 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 no. Back, 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 back. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Navigation system ready. Call me Harry. Standing by. Gotcha. Call me Harry. Navigation system ready. Five in the holster. You're making my day. Standing by. Oh, best thing we now get would actually be for him to. F nah, damn it. He's not going to throw or I drive against ready. the next wall. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shoot him down, shoot him down. Stunned him. Yes, 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 yes. Wait. As you defeat the private, final privateer vehicle, you return to a KJL trading company caravan, or at least what's left of them. Radio. A KJL trading company thanks you profusely. I regret to inform you that they are mostly transporting food cubes, but they do have an EMP blaster you can have. Thanks! I don't say no to free stuff. <laughs> yeah, I know. What's up here? Oh frack, we almost oh god, we almost have no true shite. Judging from track of destruction of the wake of numerous warbands, you can only assume we are near the James Fay warband. Oh no, we are not going to do that right now because otherwise we will die. Uh oh. Open radio channels. You're a stranded fools, ready for a picking. What do you want? Begging for mercy, champion working. Hmm over trade? Let's hear it. Parts for fuel? Nah. Ah, never should have bored talking to you dogs. Prepare to die! I'm ready. Harry. What now the hell? Systems ready. My head shook every which way, but loose. Standing by. I was born ready. Standing by. Navigation systems ready. Call me Harry. Standing by. I commander. I commander. My head shook every which way, but loose. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. No. Damn it. Almost got him, but Call didn't really. Harry. Navigation systems ready. Don't mess with my head. Oh, you're, you're making no, my no, 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 down, down, down. Ah, oh, damn it. Go. You're making my day. Standing by. Don't mess with my head. Yes, got one. Ah, I got a shield, you fool. Try me again, punk. Navigation systems ready. Don't mess with my head. These guys seem really, really out of it. Navigation My head should ready which way but loose. 
Navigation systems ready. Come on, get the shield down. Standing by. Navigation systems ready. Try me again, punk. You're making my day. Standing by. Using the last remains of your fuel, you've managed to defeat the privateers. You managed to recover 18 points of fuel. Wait! Head to camp! Quickly! Problem is I don't have any money to buy new fuel. Doesn't make it any better. No sorry. However... Let's see, we do have some stuff. Maybe we can... We have... Oh, we have a second AMP blast? Oh, cool! I didn't even know you could do that. Um, I know this one can't get a new weapon, but this one can. Yeah! Who is going to be armed to the teeth? This guy is... I... Sweet! Okay. Now, I'm going on a quick break, and when I return, we're going to continue this. Stay tuned! And we are back! Hi! Now, as you might remember, our situation is... bad. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really bad. And we're out of fuel. Uh-oh. Call me Harry. You're making my day. My head shook every which way but loose. 45 in the holster. Navigation systems ready. Don't mess with my head. Walk in the tightrope. 45 in the holster. Yeah. Your evasion. Navigation systems. Don't mess ready. with my head. You're making my day. Don't mess with Stand my head. Up. Speed to full. I commander, I commander. Try me again, punk. No! No! The road warrior! Main engines engaged. I have a feeling like this is not going to end well. Like, not at all. Yeah. Oh frack, even our health is already mostly gone. Damn it. Navigation systems ready. No. <sighs> Damn it. 
Right. So, as you've seen so far, we've gone for tonight through several games actually. We've gone through Risk of Rain, Surrender, The Fleet, we've gone through Convoy, we've looked at UFO Aftershock. I hope you enjoyed this look at some of the very few strange or stranger games. I do hope I'll see you again on Sunday at 8pm when it's time, especially next time, for Victory Assured, here on Twitch. My name's Richard Ehrman. You've been watching Let's Play Friday Strangers Games Collection. We are going to continue on Sunday. If you like what you saw, give me a follow on Twitch or a like, share and as well subscribe on YouTube. Okay, so thank you for watching and I bid you good night. Until I see you again with Walter Skater. Bye bye.